Oh, shit, buddy. We're past three minutes, so when this VOD gets uploaded to YouTube, they won't murder me. That's been a consistent concern for me. Yeah, I maybe before Thursday I'll update the stream layout, because until I get a new webcam, it's just not worth having the layout for the webcam. Maybe we'll... I'm staring, and I'm like, hmm... I should fix that. Okay, so I did look into the Alice crashing problem. Chat, I did. Um, it's pretty interesting. Because nobody knows why it happens. <laughs> They're just like, yeah, I mean, if you turn down the settings and then load in the game, it should be fine. You can turn it back up afterwards if you want. And it just works, apparently. I verified my game files before um, getting into things, but apparently that just fixes it. Apparently. Like, that was the only solution on the Steam forum, and everyone's like, really? And then they tr try it, and there's a post, like, two posts later, where they're like, yeah, checked it, it works. So, I guess that's what we gotta do, is alter settings, and then Alice works. Don't know why, don't know how. She just does. Okay. Configuration. Video. Sorry, I'm playing with it. What can I turn off? Graphics, no. Only pop-ups for metal. Damn it. Don't you fucking pop up at me. Uh, you would. About how to use the rabbit. You... I don't have an angry amount. I really need to commission some good amounts. You get... You get dooted at. I should update the dude amount as well, because that was when I was very mask presenting. <laughs> okay that you get from me. Fingers crossed. I turned down the settings. Boom. This game looks really bad with the settings turned down. But apparently now I can turn them all back up. And everything's fine. I'm going into the painting. It's working. I assume it can be seen as well. Oh. Did I not save that I did some things in this stage? Domestic harmony and order. The fruitful landscape encouraged industry, tolerance, and cooperation. Loving families flourished, happy children, dear friends, grateful for their well-being, lived for generations, secure, active, and free. But a sudden onslaught of alien attacks broke their fragile bodies and nearly crushed their generous spirits. I feel like I played this. Am I crazy? Ouch. This feels really familiar. Yay! No, I am not. Okay, so I did in fact play this already. Played through most of it, then it became baldy time, and it just didn't save. Because that sucks that it didn't save. Usually it's really good about saving. Also, kudos to your memory. Hello.
Donkey Kong. What? That definitely has happened to me before, but I really didn't touch that. Donkey Kong. This is also my daddy's name. And he named me Donkey Kong Jr. Oh my gosh. These are mini games, Maddie. They made the interesting decision to base autosave before and after them. What do you mean? That statement isn't clicking in my brain. And they didn't they didn't give me a manual save option either. That's my biggest problem. I got another peach. Play through the minigame or start over in the minigame. Okay. Oh, I didn't finish the minigame. That's what it was. Okay. No, I don't mind that I had to restart the mini- I, I thought I had finished the whole minigame. But yeah, as long as it's like I was partway through the minigame and just tapped out. Yeah, cool, whatever. That's not really that weird. A lot of games do that. If you tap out in the little of sort in the middle of a section, they're just like, well, you you gave up, so you'll have to come back and do it. Like that's really not a big deal to me. I thought it was a I got through this painting section entirely, and then it uh, then it decided to kick me back. Gotcha. Your memory is very detail oriented. Get on your memory. Oh, I feel like I made this comment the last time I hit this, but this is some crash one, climb the tower crap. Don't. Oh yeah, because I died right on this because I thought the branch was a platform that was standable. It wasn't. I would love if the camera pulled back just a little. Yeah, just like that. How'd you know? Yeah. I need to have a sippy of water. I'm so, like, accursedly thirsty. Viscerally, even. Thirsty. I am so thirsty. Big water. Hydrate or die straight, hell yeah. Whew. Okay, let's do this. Um cool. I was right at the end, wow. Ah, uh, Alice. It's good to be back. Your skin has never been softer. There. Samurai Wasp Archer. Hey, check that thing out. I'm supposed to look at the bomb, not at me. Oops.
cripes, dude. I forgot you can't sidestep anything in this game. You gotta, you gotta dodge hard. Cool. That's a little twisted looking. Okay, we don't shoot it. So what is my focus being drawn to here? Because there's a chain up there I really want to pull. Is that where I need to go then? I guess there's an enemy over here, so probably... She's just here now? Okay. Oh yeah, she wasn't there before. Oh, there is something lower. Part of the scenery, I guess, yeah. It was way simpler than I thought it was. That tends to be a trend with Alice. Oh. Nifty. Okay. I like the dress in this uh, stage. It's very nice. Not my favorite of her dresses, but it is up there for me. It's a good dress. Okay, when I dodge, does it do the Mr. Conductor Magic Railroad whistle from Thomas? No, that's part of the music. It's like a toot! Like a fleeting little whistle. Just keep an ear out for it. I love the Queensland one the most. Okay. Hopefully it's good. There it was. That's totally the sound effect from Thomas and the Magic Railroad. Hold up. Hold up. Let me... Let me pull this up for you. Let me share it with you. Uh... Nope. Right there, that one. I'm going to crank him for you. <coughs> I sneezed right as he happened. You hearing him? That is absolutely, I'm liking that video by the way, because that's all the different Mr. Conductor's whistles. Yeah, so then listen for him at the, it seems like it's at the end of the loop in the level theme. saw the platforms existed but you oh you move I see oh that's jank I wasn't even pushing anything there was a minecraft cave noise but Right there. In the distance you can hear him. It's totally the same whistle. Yeah. 
It's totally the same whistle. That's wild. That movie is so bad, and yet I have started watching it semi-frequently just because it's like it's really nostalgic. Oh, hey, bottle. It is. No, I will. I will not try to defend it as high cinema. It's really bad. Even for Thomas standards, it's so bad. I've seen it a lot more than twice for no good reason. Oh, that was just a secret. Wow. Oh, never mind. No, he altered this wind gust. There we go. Bad, but entertaining. How do I focus the problem when there's so many problems? Yay, I got all the guys. Whew. Combat's starting to get not so easy. Hobby horse is cheapest, but Vorpal Blade. Level 3 is just a good situation. Gotcha, these are all enemies who are pretty easily toppled by Tea Kettle if you can hit them. Good to know. Let me guess. Yep. Wow, that bomb ability is so useful. I did what? What did I do that was sick? I just heard Mr. Conductor's whistle again. Man, he's going between Sodor and Shining Time a lot. Get all those guys. I don't know. I just fought them. I used the tea kettle, and they took a lot of damage because the tea kettle's good here, I guess. 
doing really poorly on this slide. I think I could safely put Alice in the 3D platformer genre. This feels very Battle for Bikini Bottom a lot of the time. Which is weird because this is a decade younger than Battle for Bikini Bottom is. But it's got all the same vibes. I mean, minus the fact that this one's spooky and Battle for Bikini Bottom's a Spongebob game, but... Dead. That works too. about okay cool oh I see the mr. conductor whistle is gonna get me the whole time we're in this world I hope you know oh pick a nick a basket uh. Got to ride the mahjong tile to the ceramic doll of a crying Asian woman. On some lilies. So there's gotta be more things to fight or else the game broke again and I really hope the game doesn't break again. I'd rather rant about the Mr. Conductor whistle the whole time. But... Size hitbox for that button. Basket for me, yeah. Had Okay, up see daisy. Around the tea, another crying ceramic woman. Oh yeah, you can't forget the the tea being poured everywhere. Very, uh, perfect, totally. Oh, I got Resident Evil'd. Radcliffe asked me in just the once, odd duck, very proud of his artifact, and lame, I think he said, and partial to Tokugawa Japan. 
Doesn't seem the samurai type, but perhaps that's why. Yeah, whenever I come out in those rooms, whatever direction I'm holding is no longer the correct direction for the way Alice is walking, but it continues to push Alice in that way. So I'm like, okay. Whatever, dude, you know? Cool. Yeah, this game, I don't know how I want to rate this game. And to be fair, I don't have to yet. I haven't beaten it yet, right? So, I got time, but... I'm not sure, because I, like I like to rate my games after I beat them. It's a fun thing I enjoy, and I'm like, how do I, how do I feel about Alice Madness Returns? And I just don't know. The conflagration's point of origin was obvious. First, the library caught fire, and it spread disastrously when the gas line exploded. Here we go. Firehouse. Okay. Have a little sippy of water while we watch. Oh, Alice plans for my life. Thought. I survived because she showed me how to escape. I didn't leave the lamp in the library, and Dinah didn't knock it over. The lamp and Dinah were upstairs when I went to bed. Dinah was in the room with me when the fire started. Huh. So it wasn't the cat and the lamp. Interesting. A lot of questions here, not a lot of answers. <laughs> Orphan with an inheritance? I see, somebody wanted it. Somebody wanted her dead and lit the fire. Okay, so the... Paper manises are getting fucked up by the samurai bugs. The paper monks. The door More ahead layers, is but that's sealed. later. Okay. Whoa, poor Only guys. Only by playing yeah. the correct sequence of bells can it be open. A dubious honor, I suspect. Are you ready? Oh gosh. in my memory like twinkle twinkle little bat get to the tree Alice little Help bat our brothers oh hey they didn't do the ramp thing with her they did the breath of the wild stair thing oh well Actually, maybe they just made it so on these this type of ramp or walk cycles different. What do you mean the same tune as last time?
Her feet clipping. What is this? Oh, look at her. Look at her feet. Oh my god, her heels. Her ankles. What is. Oh no, Alice. <laughs> oh, gotcha. Same as the Sea Rhythm game. Gotcha. Right. Look at her ankles. Oh my god. Is she okay? Is she okay? Oh my god! Why do feet like me for real, for real? You see it, right? Her ankles are like collapsed in on themselves. No, but she's like me for real, for real. I do that. What? Show me right now. Show me how you do that. Okay. Hold on. I have hyper, um... Oh, hypermobility. I have hypermobility problems. That would explain it. What do you mean? Like a good thing to pop my leg against. My feet are like hurt because she's on a slope that's doing that to her. Maybe if you can put the yeah, step up on a little. Yeah, that's fine and dandy, but she's not on anything. She's, look. She, look. She's on that slope. Look at her feet. She's not. Well, yeah, but that's at every single staircase, bro. I thought you meant how her ankles were positioned. Yes. Well, yeah. when they're not on a slope, how are her ankles like that also? They'll stand on a flat surface. Just behold her legs going through that stair in the middle. Weep! That's me when I clip through the Balfour stairs. <laughs> like, right here is where it looks fucked, because there is no slope here. Yeah. Oh, my watch is rewarding me for standing up. Look at that. There's no sl there's nothing under her. Me when me when I Right? That's not, <laughs> that that like makes sense. She's like harshly I can't even bend my foot that far. Yeah. She's like harshly cranking her ankles. She said, "You know what? Stand still." You know what? <laughs> her bones breaking. In her position, I would be too. Yeah, honestly. Something tells me I'm not gonna love this level since the whole theming is like, oh guys, it's Asian culture. Here are the three things Americans know about Asian culture. Right. Okay. That's what I will say is at least a lot of the a lot of the enemy choices and stuff have like a little bit deeper meaning. Yeah. Only thing you remembered was the dress because the florals are real. Okay, where is this fucking headstone that's spawning them all in? I really thought you were gonna say a tablecloth. I bet you did! I'm talking about the dress, not your suit. I've never seen your suit. Oh. Um. Well, fuck. I'm sure you look really good in it. Like to be fair, suits usually have tablecloth patterns on them. Like... Whoa, Tails! I just blew some shit up! Um... Oh. <laughs> no, no, I, I, I can't say that on stream. I can't say that on stream. That's all. That's all there is to it. At least I don't think I can. Maybe, maybe somebody with more more gravitas where Twitch loves them enough to protect them, but not me. Not me. Uh. Was that you settling in?
Oh, you, you did. Okay. It sounded like like a knuckle knock, and I was like, is that somebody? No. You had to toot. Okay. Valid. Mwahahaha. E he he he. Toot. <laughs> you know, <laughs> one of the sad. What is it? <laughs> you know. Yeah. That one I wasn't even touching. Well, that one I should have been off the track. Oh. Oh, I did the Mr. Conductor whistle again. Do you know when he goes, sparkle, sparkle, and then it like fades out with a little sparkle? It literally does the same toot with the same little fade out sparkle in the track. It's so. Uh, I'll show you after stream. Because I already showed it on stream once. <laughs> Uh, this level's gonna make me want to rewatch the worst movie of all time. What hurt me? I'm clear. Something hurt me in the cutscene. <laughs> Something hurt me again. Oh my god, it's one of the little fucking mites that I like to hit with a hammer. Don't know where they came from. Hit him with a hobby horse, though. <laughs> Okay, the tea is decorative, at least on the floor. Didn't know if they were gonna pull some. Well, tea's hot, so floor is lava bullshit or not. Even though they made the tea watercolored, which is to say transparent. I don't think I'm supposed to do this this way. But, okay, yeah. Alright. Enemy's dead. Here we go. Oh, okay. Boom. I was not, but I was doing it that way, and it almost worked. If I could just get a little more distance and height on the jump across here, I would have been set. Consistently getting anything out of Alice is a little, um, yeah. Consistent movement is not her uh, aesthetic. <laughs> Me either. Uh, but in platformers it should be. Speaking of platformers, Mario Wonder, this Friday. I'm so excited. I'm gonna probably do a big old recording session Friday night, I think. What's with all the little slugs just spawning? Oh, it's happening again. Small ledge. What part of the small ledge was it? I don't know. Not my problem anymore. Oh yeah, four blade. Oh cool. Kill them. Ooh, kill them. Get them. Kill them. Slay them. What is fighting me? Where? Show me, show me what's fighting me. The floor? Yeah. I'd rather hear my Mr. Conductor whistle. Oh. Oh, hello there. Oh, hello there. There we go. Shout out to the time I bugged out the game super hard and got locked in the combat music for forever. It's a funny little game this is. Cool. A resident in my evil and I almost perished for it. Is this fan on me? He is. It's just really hot in here. Put out a thing like, hi, we can't turn down our thermostat? 
What's happening? I'm going to open the window pretty it'll, soon. It'll, like, go up. It'll but up and then it'll get rid I might open the window, frankly. So I'm like overheating. You don't platformers. I know you don't platformers. What the fuck, Alice? You enjoy seeing me breeze through this? It's because the platforming's not hard. It's part of my problem with like, I'm like, yeah, I guess she gets the platformer pass because she gives the vibes of a platformer. But the issue is, nothing here is a challenging platformer, which doesn't mean it inherently needs to be, like, it's not a platformer. Pa platformers are not inherently challenging. There's two sides of platformer. There's precision and there's self-expression. Self-expression gives you a wide variety of viable options at all times. If you can do multiple moves to solve the same problem, it's a self-expression platformer. If you must do a precise set of options in order to not die and to solve the problem, it's more of a do the correct thing to get through, it's a precision platformer. Alice is neither? The platforming is not like a very tight challenge, can you do this specific thing perfectly? And it's not a, um, it's not a, well, here's the level, get through it however you can because you have a wide, what? What the hey? Okay, um, because you have a wide range of options that are all viable to do this task. Like Mario 64 the mission wall kicks with work can be done with well not well yeah without wall kicks or with fewer wall kicks than intended with the right number of wall kicks intended with side flips with a triple jump with a back flip man left i guess yeah like that that's an expression platformer crash bandicoot you have like three moves total jump slide and walk and spin right jump slide and spin and it'll always be one of those moves that solves your problem you know? And that's that's a precision platformer because the level's designed to challenge you to perfectly use jump slide or spin. A bridge will come Alice is neither. Path, but this substance has Alice does not have a large sum of viable moves, moves, nor is the level particularly designed to really challenge you about the fact that she the jumps and glides. You will find the entrance to the next sacred cave. Mix in combat, and I don't really know what this game is. Right? Like, I guess action adventure. It's not a collectathon. It almost, right? Because battle. Right? Exactly. Like, Battle for Bikini Bottom, I'd call it a collectathon. And again, it does give the same vibe as that game to an extent. But I think the, the reason it does is because it has similar, like, this is sort of. For me, as a platforming fan and a collectathon fan, a very piss easy experience. <laughs> Alongside the, why are you busted? Why can I do this? Why am I allowed? Oh, yeah, why am I allowed to stand like this? You know? Why can't I stand here? Why can't I stand here? Well, no, I mean, like, invisible wall on something that looks standable, and then, like, fucking, uh, hitbox on midair where I can stand on empty air, I can't stand on a very standable looking platform. We are saved! Right. You're free, my friends. I would say that's busted because clearly they didn't line up the hitboxes or the collision with what they made for the terrain. Don't 
say the fact that it looks sustainable is what is poor communication. Poor communication, yeah. But then the other one of like getting caught on shit that's not that there and busted. that's yeah. That is Shit's the... broken. Or like shrinking isn't a puzzle, but they treat it like one. Like it's really hard to call this a thing. I'm like, I guess action adventure puzzle platformer maybe. I. It's really hard for me to figure out what the heck Alice is. Yeah, I mean, collectathon is inherently defined by the fact that it's like centralized around getting many things. Like having having collectibles to 100% the game does not make it a collectathon, you know. So. Otherwise, like every platformer known to man would be a collectathon. Please change targets to the one that's right in your face, Alice. With what? Jerking off? Yeah, you're really, you're really killing them. Shooting the floor. Yeah, well, I'm pretty sure I'm not in control 90% of the time because your programmers didn't finish you. Uh huh. Just to make me mad. They, they intentionally designed this to be a piece of shit. I say that as an over-negative exaggeration, I want to clear. Okay, I can't even kill all these guys. What am I wasting my time on? There's no experience point. There's no, yeah, there's no reason for me to... <laughs> you know me. Opting for optional grinding Madeline. I got fucking shot in the cutscene. That's some shit. This feels so 2000s. It's very hard for me to believe that this was in a 360 game. And I know it was, factually. But it is designed with all the quirks and flaws of something that came out in 2001. I, th I think I landed on the goo and it was just like, okay, you can jump off of that. You're allowed. I really do not know what occurred there. There's a lot of things I can just run into and walk across. Frankly. I see the keyhole. I'm not... I am paying it no mind. Although... Mm, no, I know it's there. I can't. Name me Donkey Kong Jr. Oh, they resident in my evil again. Flush the unpleasant from your mind, Alice. Reject the painful as you would the repulsive and depraved. Forgetting is an art. That was not worth it. <laughs> It was just another memory of the the doctor who's really manipulative being like, you have to forget the pain, repress it. Like, that's unhealthy. You know, I'm getting hit in a cutscene! I mean, yeah, but... One day he'll, he'll resurface. Like, like no, it, it is it is true that if it's... If it's not consciously in your brain, it can't hurt you. But he will one day return to being consciously in your brain. You'll also still have behaviors. No matter how much you suppress him, yeah. You want to talk about the kettle you're carrying, Alice? The one, the one you're holding? Yeah, well, look at that. Now it's here. Shut up. I hate you, Alice. Yeah. Instead of just shut up, Alice, I can. <laughs> <laughs> the fuck did I just want? Is this a bad time? I can. Hold on, we're all jerking off. <laughs> Hold on, we're charging. <laughs> we're, ch we're, ch we're charging our neighbors. 
<laughs> no, we're... Shut the fuck. Are you about to say something fucked? <laughs> we're charging our jizz crystal. <laughs> Do you know what I'm talking about? No, but that's fucking hilarious either way. I don't think it's called a jizz crystal. I forget what it's called. Charging oh. my jizz crystal. Yeah. So, there's a guy. He's talking to the mic, Madeline. <laughs> there's a, there's a guy. I know. Shut up. <laughs> Fuck you. Uh, there's a guy who, um, excuse me, having fun. <laughs> yeah, he <laughs> he um shoots the baby batter <laughs> into a crystal casing, or like. Put some in a crystal casing, right? Like it's shaped like it. Yeah. And then, mm-hmm. <laughs> to charge this crystal is like a good luck charm or whatever. Yeah. He jerks off on it. Like onto it. Yeah. Instead of into it. Onto it. Why? What is this man doing? <laughs> I I don't know. I forget what it's called, but... (laughs) (laughs) Sorry. Okay, okay. I had a mouthful of water and you're like, My name (laughs) is Donkey Kong. I'm thinking about this guy's (laughs) J.O. crystal. (laughs) No, I know. But I'm like, let me get a sip of water. And then you're like, Donkey Kong. And I'm imagining that... That plus the J.O. crystal, and it's just too much for my brain. But yeah, so they're they're just charging their crystal. Uh, uh, there's a pig snout out there. Oh, God. I can't tell if I like or hate this image, because I love that everything's in silhouette, but it's the amount of bloom on it. Look at this. Like, everything in silhouette looks really cool. The amount of bloom on the white does not. It is a little intense. Oh, I was supposed to... Hold on. <laughs> what did you get for making fun of me, Alice? I'm supposed to go directly there from here. Yeah. Either that or I'm supposed to bring over an air vent, but... Yeah, I'm supposed to bring over an air vent. Oops. There's no penalty for jumping in a pit, so. Donkey Kong is also my daddy's name, and he named me Donkey Kong Junior! Oh, wait, I bet I could have shot him from over there, couldn't I? I can pepper him from here, damn. Golly, that did jack shit, I think. I wonder what Ganon's up to. You know what I'm referencing, or are you just... Like, obviously Zelda, but do you know... Oh. The, the CDI Zelda games. Oh, yeah. I can't wait to bomb some Dodongos. Uh. Oh, man. Cool. That was some. That was. What is this? What is this? Look at it, look at it, it's doing it again, man. What, what? What in Sam hell? What is this? Found another one immediately. Behold. I'm having so much fun wiggling on the wall. Yeah, right. I'm having so much fun with my feet clipping into the ground and I'm wiggling into a wall. 
It is my favourite activity. Fuck you, Alice. <laughs> Fuck you, Jim! Eating all my Reese's Pieces! I'm enjoying a treat, Derek! Derek! I'm enjoying a treat, Derek! I'm sure glad that empty ground was standable. Yeah, no invisible platform there. Oh, that is so fucking like Battle for Bikini Bottom cave region. With the fucking Mario fire bars. Christ. They, they go through the wall, by the way. I just want to let everyone know. This game's a wild experience. <laughs> Maybe that's the point. Fuck you, Alice. I'm enjoying the fuck you, Alice bit a little too much, frankly. Leave her alone. I just like the idea of her being really smarmy to me, being like, this game's busted, and me being like, well, fuck you. I think she would be smarmy about it. Yeah. Not, a little, not as much as I'm making her. Yeah. I think she would be a teeny bit smarmy. She does seem to be smarmy. But only like the. Fire, Alice! Ah! Save yourself! Yeah. Wake up, yeah. Lizzie! Lizzie! Open the door! The key, Lizzie! Unlock the door! You'll burn! Wait, so was her family trying to make sure that she got out and then she had already gone out the window? That's what that seemed like. What? Well, no, because they were saying, wake up, Lizzie, come out the key, open the door, you'll burn. But she just established that the cat showed her how to escape and it showed the cat showing her how to get out the window. Oh, Lizzie. Oh, yeah, Lizzie was her sister, Doi. For some reason, my brain was like, Lizzie can be a nickname for Alice. <laughs> yeah, I, for a second, I was like that, and then I was like, Lizzie. Okay, so that was the last one. Donkey Kong. It's also my dad's name. And he named me Donkey Kong. <laughs> Junior! <laughs> Archer's dead. Whoever did it stole the wrong bedroom key. Wait, they wanted Alice dead? Specifically? They didn't just want the whole family dead? Oh. I figured it was a wanted the whole family to get all the money, but they specifically wanted Alice dead and Alice lived. Okay. Weird. I figured it was like... Yeah, they wanted everyone dead so they could take everything, and then Alice was like, Oopsies, I'm alive, and they're like, Damn it! Foiled my plans. I mean, hooray, one of them survived, you poor child. Interesting. Oh, right, you're programming. I'm really confused. <laughs> Me too, man. <laughs> Me too, man. Wait, there's a free one in the now? Oh, fuck. There was a platform there. I love being able to see what I'm... Oh, fuck. Okay, the fire's instant death. There is no leniency here. I suppose... What the fuck? What the hell? They do want that, but she was the biggest risk of surviving since she was 11 at the time and definitely able to remember it. Gotcha. What the hell? I don't even know what killed me that time. I got lost. You got lost? Yeah. Is that Alice or is that you and your programming? Oh. Yeah. yeah. I can't tell which that means. What am I helping? You Atlantis? Yeah, no. Yes. 
<laughs> what the fuck is going on? What are you saying? Please what, dude? <laughs> I'm begging you. Who? Oh. I'm begging you. Elaborate. You're shitting me. What? Too many. Too many what? Oh, it's you. Okay. Alice had, <laughs> Alice had so many Hershey kisses, she <laughs> sugared the British out of her. Abused and murdered their Pacific victims, whom they hated for being different. The invaders no. corrupted the vivid world. They assaulted. Now we suffer together, Alice. <laughs> Still, they stayed on, trying to placate their oppressors and recover their past. The cruel interlopers attacked at We intervals. suffer together now, Instead Alice. Of killing them all at once, the wretched survivors suffered in perpetual fear. <laughs> Killed you like you asked. <laughs> Alice, make up your fucking mind. I hate you. Uh, it's just what we were talking about earlier about uh, wanting to do away with every member of the family. I tooted. <laughs> we have both tooted on stream. I've done a lot more than toot on stream. I'm not too worried about it. <laughs> I've fallen asleep on stream. You said hello. I have said hello. I, I, I don't know if that clip's still around. I hope it is. Um... It was a New Year's stream. I fucking was in a blanket. My con or no, it was Game Awards. And you're like, good night. Yeah, I have my Mario Kart blanket, and I fell right asleep in my chair, which I never. Why does it always happen? This is gonna be like Aaron playing Red plant, purple plant, blue plant. Why is he only sprout when I show up? The fuck just killed me. Get biggering, you idiot. Also, sillies. Get, get what now? Biggering. Biggering. Yeah, get biggering. Biggering. Yeah, like biggering, but biggering. Yeah, gotcha. Yeah. yeah. My brain went to the Lorax. Biggering. Biggering. No biggering. No. -uh. Well, I made it, didn't I? <laughs> what the fuck is going on? I can't go over the giant gap that I can clearly jump high enough to go over. Oh. Duh, how foolish of me to want to use the platforming mechanics in an expressive manner like the game design suggests, only to find out that they're trying to make a precision platformer that doesn't require precision! I love video games. I love video games too. I love video games too, buddy. Are you okay over there? Yeah, oh my god. Crunched. Not anymore. Sisyphus, no! Sisyphus, yes! Me too. Um, unfortunately, no. It's just forever will be very short. Maybe I want to. It's not for real. Yeah. Gotcha. You got swallowed by the food. I know. Why did they make this? Tell me. Tell me why. Ain't nothing but a heartache. Ain't nothing but a mistake. I never want to hear you say, I want it. Yeah. Yeah. Hamburger. 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 
Wisdom too. I've seen it. I just don't remember. It yeah, that's like my favorite part of it, where he starts. He, he does a knock knock. Who's there? Monica. Monica. Who? A harmonica starts playing the harmonica. Yeah, the other one starts howling along. You had the right idea though. though. Uh, bought it off eBay or whatever the Weird Al version is, or the weird, yeah, the Weird Al version is. Um, I don't know. What are you talking about, Weird Al, babe? <laughs> Bye. Thank you. I guess a better statement about this game is not that it's not designed as a precision platformer. It's designed as a precision platformer where your controls fight you, not the level. Well, there's a difference between the level hates me and it's a challenge to overcome and the controls hate me and I have little agency. That's why I say video games. You'll show us later? Okay. That's mildly concerning. It's a little ominous. You were saying? What? My camera's broke. Mine too. No, like. Oh! Game. <laughs> in your game. <laughs> I know your camera's broken. I'm sad about it. It worked for a solid year, though. More than that. Oh, it worked for a good long while. Yeah, I feel like. That's good. That's not a good long while. Well, I mean, how long He was like 20 bucks. <laughs> Yeah, but also longer would be nicer. Volume, timbre, pitch, duration. I had a really good, it was good pitch, good volume, good timbre. It just was short. Like on the walk back from the, from the dining hall with Basil. Uh, Basil. Basil dubbed it a nine, that was earlier today. On the walk back from uh, the dining hall, they were like, damn, it echoed off the building. Dang. Like it was good timbre, good pitch, and then that level volume. Damn. It's just that it was a little short. Yeah. And we were like, fuck, dude. Yeah, that's fair. Right, but yeah. So Basil and I were joking about how we're on a quest for a 10 in my burp earlier. It's the closest we've gotten by far. Because it was, it was, like I said, everything but duration was fucking perfect. How did you go from right in front of me to up there? Oh! Oh! Okay. Oh! Okay. We collected him. It's okay. Oh, I know what happened. You have a, basically a magnet on you, so when you get close enough for the tracks towards you, 
But he started in the door. I know. Which is why it clicked, because it started to attract you right, not only as it was in the door, but also as it was coming to face you, the door was opening. And the door is being pushed away. Yeah, so it pushes it away, and then it's getting dragged towards you still in the animation. And it just is like, yippee! This is not a puzzle. Once more, the shadow dragon winds along the This is not a puzzle. The Follow the dragon, Alice. Oh, ah, I see Salt how it goes. Mantis. Makes perfect sense, sense, really. At least, now it does. <laughs> Go find the box. Dare you for this? Up with that Speaking of, I heard these, well, these these guys made little blub blub sounds when they appeared. It's not just me calling leeches oysters. I promise. It's good fun hitting them with this giant hammer. I, I like that I just hear whoop, boom and they're dead. And like it's the dramatic swing. It's oh they're just cropping up infinitely. Which you know what actually yeah I'm grinding my health real quick. I want to fill my health bar a little bit. That last fight took some out of me. It's not grinding, grinding. It's filling my health bar. More. Cool. We're done. Hey. He's, wait! How do I defeat all of them? I guess I just had to kill all of them in one fell swoop. That or I just had to kill an absurd amount of them and I finally hit the absurd amount as I'm like, what? The game heard me being concerned. Oh my god, I'm, I might have to open this window. I swear to fucking god, I'm dying over here. Yeah, okay. I'm... Well, the AC just turned off. I don't care. He can cool the room while the window's open, okay. frankly. Okay. I think I might pop. Like, I'm. No, you're good. You're good. I'm overheating. I am not trying to tell you not to open the window. Yeah. Plus, you can never tell if he's the AC or the heat. Well, Him. it's not going to heat the building because we're not at a point where it needs to be heated. Yeah, but I've been hot and the heat has kicked on. Excuse me. I've been hot and the room gets hotter before, so yeah. I refuse to accept logic because this building doesn't run on it. Sure. <laughs> I mean, listen, if you can explain I mean, all the bullshit that happens here outside of everything's decrepit and breaking... <laughs> Because no, everything's, like, everything's everything is totally decrepit like like and yes, but also total everything's decrepit and breaking is all the more reason for shit to happen spontaneously. Yes. I thought he was jammed for a second. He's being really resistant. Wow. No, yeah, he's kind of hard to pull up. Before and now all of a sudden he is. Why? Why does everything in our room fucking hate us? Um, because we're gay. Oh. The room is trans and homophobic. The room is transphobic. Knew it! I knew it! Fucking knew it. Thank you for telling me that one. Fucking, uh, duh. Fucking, duh! James. James? <laughs> the room. We, we're naming the room James. I am. Sounds good. Or maybe, like, nah, James is, like, kind of... Yeah. Carolyn. 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 I'm gonna think of Portal every time. Exactly. Aaron, but Carolyn was so sweet. I know. She got fucked. That's, that's, I know. That's fair, the room's really sweet, but it's getting fucked exactly. by Exactly. Yeah. yeah! Oh, Carolyn. Yeah. Okay. You've sold me on naming the room Carolyn. Yay! This just in, folks. We named the room Carolyn. So we <laughs> was set on, on stream, and the VOD will be posted, so you can hear it a hundred times a day. If you know, you know. <laughs> Just saddle the portal reference in our portal reference. Are you going to bed over there? Nope. Buddy, I'm, I'm calling you out. You are nestled in your comfy little blanket in your comfy little bed. I'm not mad. Okay. I'm not mad at the camera, dude. I get it, but it's 11 o'clock at night and you're a sleepy man. 
Uh huh. And then set a little timer and just like wave. Okay. Okay, cool. Yeah. You're you're prepared. Fine. No, no thirty minute naps, says Morrow. <laughs> or uh, astronaut says no thirty minute naps. Aye aye, Captain. I'm slowing down for a second so I can not yell at Unity. Fair. Yeah. I hope I'm sure he did. What is this? Why is this an invisible wall? Why can't I hop over the foot that's shorter than I am? That window is making all the difference, holy shit. Oh, dude. Doing it for me. <laughs> the death added everything to that. Not again, thank you. I'm sure a hundred percenting this game is where it gets hard, but right now it is a relatively easy experience. I was say I both do and don't condone that. Yeah. And something like this, where it's more accessible but still a full-fledged game, cool. In its most extreme form that we see a lot current day, where it's a fucking walking simulator, no thanks, gang. Nah. <laughs> I just I just defy walking sims. Right. I heard my Mr. Conductor whistle. I guess I'll go this way because I followed that last time and it didn't really help me any. Here we go. Keyhole. Or carrying the hobby horse despite its non existence right now. Cool, cool, cool. Thank you, Alice. Golden bottle. There. Ugh. It is dark and moody up in this area. Spooky. I like it. Some good. This game is a constant state of atmospherically nice. That is what I will say. Speaking of, now the ceramic ladies are bugs. Trippy. I like the atmosphere of this game. It's really nice. I realize sometimes when I'm playing this game, I'm like outwardly overly negative, and a lot of it is silly. But I can understand. Why someone may uh, see it as being very negative, so. Want to clarify. There are things I like about this game. I just like to be a grouch sometimes. Mostly why you like it, that's totally fair. It's really, really nice. Oh, I'm missing one. Really? I assume he's this way, and if he's not, I pop like a balloon. We'll probably get to the next autosave, and that'll be it, because it's already been an hour and a half. 
As much as this, I love this game, I am tires, dude. Cool. It's fun to look at and listen to, right? Yeah, exactly. Now you're picking up what I am throwing down. Oh, did I make it unsolvable for myself? Oh, I ran out of time. Oh, our moves. Shoot. Okay. There's no way it's this easy. The answer is no. No, it's not. Christ. Okay, hold on. Why don't I think for a minute? <laughs> Look at that. Look at what using your brain does, huh? Three moves. Open. Now it appears that I can continue my ascent to the peak. Now it appears that I can continue my ascent to the peak. Thank you, Alice. I realize it just auto saved, so. Cool, cool. It's another one in the books. I hope y'all enjoyed. A quick hour and a half of Alice in Madness Returns. A little Alice in Wonderland action. Yippee! Next time, Thursday. Alien, Alice. Yippee. Yeah, have a good night. Bye bye.